I got the Super 8 camera um, for $10 off the sky. It was, the whole experience was like pretty interesting. It took me half an hour to get there. And the guy only had one eye and he just like was a super kind, sweet man. And he just like had a bunch of stuff in his garage and pulled out this little brown bag and gave me the camera and, and I bought it for $10. The, there was a roll already in the camera when I bought it. Um, and that was a roll I was gonna use for the film. I, it looked like it was brand new. So I just went, went with it. And with that, I decided to do my portrait on my dog. After some quick research, I learned that a Super 8 cartridge can film for around 3 minutes. And this one seemed to be blank based on the reader, so I got excited and made a plan. This now over a year of quarantine brought my dog and I closer than we've ever been before. He really did become my best friend. And over time, we developed some favorite spots we like to go to hang out. After a whole 47 seconds, after just 47 seconds of filming, it was over. So that means there was already a two and a half minutes of footage on the roll, um, mm -hmm. which I don't know what it is. The film goes back to 1973, I think, and um, the camera is made in 1959. I did send off the roll of film a few days ago um, to get developed, and I should get it back within a week or two. Honestly, what are the chances? The who of this footage is completely unknown to me, only an assumption that this couple and their little white dog were at the beach somewhere around 1980. Once again, what are the chances that 40 years later, I would complete the final 47 seconds of this film roll at the exact same location and even crazier with my little white dog? Yeah, maybe this was a coincidence. Or maybe everything really does happen for a reason. But one thing that's certain for me personally is a strange sense of friendship that I feel with these total strangers. It's really something that I could have never expected out of this project. It's safe to say that this is my little treasure, and I'm grateful to this camera for shielding this cartridge of film from the world for so many years. So will I ever meet these people? I doubt it. But my emotions are hard to explain in words, or truly express what I'm thinking about the situation. Because I share this, these three minutes that have traveled through time, and somehow landed in my hands. So yeah, in a sense, it feels like I have met them. Um, and I feel like I know them in a way. At a time when the gears of life seemed to be stuck, for $10, I was reminded to expect the unexpected. In my hands, I held a 4x4 inch, odd-defying, 3 minutes. <laughs> 